Hi guys, my name is Ferdy and in this video series I will talk about the amazing features of the Astra theme. One of the best themes for WordPress. There's a free version that has a lot of capabilities, but there are also premium upgrades and in this video series I will cover every topic. If you want to get one of the premium packages of the Astra theme, you can go to ferdycorp.com forward slash Astra. This is an affiliate link, so when you buy this through my link I get a commission, so thank you for that. Then you can choose a package and click on get started. You can pay with credit card or PayPal. Then you can download all the premium plugins, upload them to your website, activate them, and then through these tutorials, I will show you step by step how all the premium plugins work. If you like what you're seeing so far, please like this video. And if you want to see more upcoming videos, please consider to subscribe and click on the bell notification so you'll get an update when I upload a new video. Now let's get started. In this video, I will show you how you can set up the scroll to top module. I go to the back end in a new tab, holding command control. I click on customize. I drag this to the left. And if I go to appearance, extra options, and I scroll down, I see over here, scroll to top. It's not activated yet. If I go to layout, you see those options over here. But if I activate this, scroll to top, and I refresh the page and I go to layout. You see the option over here. What does it mean? If I scroll down, you see a scroll to top button. If I click over here, right down in the corner, I go to the top of the page, no matter how far I am. If I click here, I go up like that. We can configure this. There are not much options, but it's not necessary. So I scroll down. Where do I want to show this? If I say on the desktop, it will be shown on the desktop. If I would say desktop and mobile, it will be shown on both. So if I go to this version, you see it over here like that. I like it. So I go back to the desktop. Where do I want to position it? Well, everybody does it right. So I see no reason why you should do it left because people are used to clicking at the right button to go back to the top. The icon size, we can make it bigger. How far can you go? Yeah, that's nice. Maybe a little bit smaller. How about 30? I think it's too big. It should not be distracting, but it should be noticeable. 25, mm, 20. Yes. Then the background icon radius. If I bring this up with the arrows, you see a nice radius. And if I take a look at my website, everything is in square. So I see no reason why I should give it a radius. So I like it this way. Sorry, zero. Then the icon color, which is the arrow color. Then the background color, you can change it to get the attention. But it should not be distracting. So maybe a nice blue color, a little bit dark like that. Okay. Then we have the hover color. When I hover over it, I still want the arrow to be white. So I leave this as this. And here I can say, give me this color, copy it and I make it a bit lighter. So when I hover over it, you see a slight change. And when you click on it, you go up. So that's it. That are all the settings. And I like it. I publish it. I close this. I close this. And now when I scroll down, I can click over here and I go back to the top. I want to thank you for watching this video. I hope you learn a ton of stuff. Feel free to like this video and to subscribe for more upcoming videos. And I hope you have a great day. And you will see me next time. Bye-bye.